some terms in the swinger lifestyle that you may hear or see on apps that you don't know what they mean. Well, here's the meaning of them, such as hot wife. Hot wife is a woman who is married or in a relationship per se, ma truly married though, that will play on her own with other couples or with other individuals with the consent of her partner, of her husband. Um, sometimes there's video recording involved. Sometimes there is pictures involved, whatever it might be, their dynamic. And it's about that reclaiming, reconnecting side of it uh, after the play. Another term that you may hear is the stag vixen combination and what it is is a stag or vixen you find your partner is the most desirable uh, individual and human out there and playing with somebody almost rekindles and makes you want your partner more and it's that joy of watching your partner have fun with somebody else knowing ultimately that they want you more the stag is the male side of this and the vixen is the female side of this dynamic another terms that you may end up hearing is something such as parallel play which is playing with your partner and no one else physically but maybe in the same room as them or in the vicinity of them so that you can watch hear the same sounds but there is no touching whatsoever a uh, soft swap is a very common term that you'll hear and a lot of times when people especially if they're new to the lifestyle uh, soft swap is no male bottom organs inside of female below the belt bottom organs um, yes the mouth may be involved the hands may be involved there may be kissing and stuff but there is none of the any organs below the belt going inside of the other organs of the opposite sex below the belt uh, when it comes to uh, separate room play that means playing with somebody else in a different room than your partner um, that is a dynamic that is out there and these are just common terms that you hear on lifestyle apps and the main reason on apps that you see a lot of these different terms out there is because ultimately you want to know right away if you're going to swipe on somebody or if you're talking to somebody if you're going to connect in that play style wise because ultimately we're, we're on apps and you're, and you're talking to others because you want to play we do enjoy the friendship side of it and the friendship side of it is amazing and you do make some you know amazing friends in it but you're not going to invest this ton of energy in somebody if there is no desire or, or ability to play because your dynamics are different so when it comes down to these terms it takes a little bit of time, but believe me, after a while, you realize what all these terms are and it all makes sense and it makes it a lot easier and quicker to connect and meet people.